What's going on there, YouTube? My name is Cadet Caboose, and uh, I feel like I owe an explanation to you, my audience. Whether you're new here or you've been here for a little while, I'm looking at you, CC. I know you have a different name. CCJJKK95. To see your comment this morning, you got me out of bed, buddy. I jumped up and uh, was like, I need to make a video because I was I was I wasn't sure if I wanted to do this or not. I sat down several times over the last uh, three or four weeks trying to record something to explain where I've been, what's been going on, and uh, what is happening now. So where have I been? Well, simple explanation has been I've just been working. It's 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 literally just that more. Hey, quit it. You guys bark and I gotta start over and it sucks. Come on. Just calm down. Just calm down. Be okay, Be okay, Be okay. Be okay. Be okay. So about five years ago, I moved to Texas. The idea being that I was going to move in with a buddy of mine. I was going to have um, better internet. We were going to uh, do some podcasting together and work on some videos together. Unfortunately, things didn't really work out. And um, I, I ended up in a situation where I went from being able to stream pretty much every single day uh, to uh, not even having stable internet. And from there, I went into... Um, truck driving where I had practically no internet except for what I could get on my phone. And so streaming or making videos sort of, I could make, I could have made videos. I could have, but everything that I could have or would have made videos about didn't excite me. It wasn't, it wasn't motivating to try to make a video about how to make ramen noodles into you know, pad tie using peanut butter from a thing. And it's silly. Truck driving is not something that I'm passionate about. It was to me just a job and sort of a means to an end. And that's what I've been working on since um, the announcement of Halo Infinite back in uh, 2018. Uh, 2018 was the reveal trailer for Halo Infinite. And I had been kind of keeping an eye on it. And then in 2019, um, we had the uh, uh, we had that big reveal with the with the pilot trailer, and that's when I truly started like really like trying to figure out how to do all of this, like all of this, because like it's not just like oh I have a nice room, I've got the acoustic panels behind me, I've got this you know microphone set up. It's a lot of stuff. Every part of my setup from my keyboard to my mouse to my audio interface and even my camera I spent two years planning and then finally executing on what equipment I wanted how I wanted it all set up and now we're finally here we've we, we've we've reached the pinnacle the apex the 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 point that I've been shooting for for over two years. We're here. And 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 just just when we were we thought like the finish line is 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 right there. I I have I have like two more weeks to just test everything, make sure it's perfect, make sure everything is in great working order. The lighting looks right, because right now it looks like I think No, this side's too bright. Um I wanted to make sure that everything was in order and I know why they did it. It's 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 the 20th anniversary of the game coming out in 2001. Ah, but I ho I was hoping I'd have a few more weeks just to make sure that everything was running, do a test stream. Instead I just I I rushed through finishing up the setup yesterday. Those what a pain in the ass. Nobody ever tells you online. You see people, you see people with these 
these these these nice acoustic you know panels they're very aesthetic looking they look good they help with sound uh dampening to keep it from reflecting around the room they don't tell you how big of a pain in the ass they are to uh to put up some streamers i've 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 seen it where they're that one of the panels will fall off of their background. Literally, I put those up three times, and this time I did something to make them fucking stay. They're not moving anywhere. But what a pain in the ass! They don't tell you how much of a pain in the ass they are. They're a pain in the ass. If you do not need acoustic panels and just think that they are aesthetic, buy like a poster that looks like acoustic panels because this is. <laughs> I still and I still have more to put up. I got a whole corner over here that that needs uh, uh, that needs to be dampened. <laughs> so this is essentially the culmination of sort of an idea that I had three years ago, and then two years of uh, of work to get here. I, uh, I I'm no longer a truck driver. Uh, that was a recent change for me. I, uh, I, I, I moved into the office of the uh, company that I worked for. So instead of uh, driving the trucks, I will be sort of managing other truck drivers now. It's a bit mentally exhausting, uh, at least right now, because I'm still learning and there's so much stuff to learn. It's not a simple matter of I just need to call everybody and track them on a computer and, and see where they're at and stuff. It's, 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 it's much more complicated than even I had uh, maybe guessed it would be when I, uh, uh, when, I, when I accepted the position. But it's fun. It's interesting. I'm learning a lot. And uh, I didn't take that big of a pay cut going from driving truck to going to the office, which I'm really happy about. But being honest with you guys, the last um, four years as a truck driver have been really mentally exhausting on me. It's one of the reasons why I didn't make videos uh, over the last four years. I tried at one point because I was going home sort of regularly, but... Um, that didn't really work out because even despite being able to go home every other day, I was still very much just mentally exhausted. I um, I went crazy there for a little while, sort of. Just not in a good place, like kind of in a dark place because I was miserable doing what I was doing. And uh, I can't tell you how, how glad I am to now not be in that place anymore to be off of the truck be back being able to do the kind of things that i love to do making youtube videos streaming being able to go out again to 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 you know meet somebody and say hey do you want to go catch a movie or uh do you want to go get some beers or you know hey do you want to come with me to the walmart and look at the toys not those toys <laughs> <laughs> Not the <laughs> I wish it didn't take so long to get here. So the last five years or so, I don't really count um, any of the content that I've made for the channel as like, you know, canon uh, for what I want my channel to be about. It's stuff that I want to go through because there's probably a few gems in there that I'd like to hold on to. But for the most part, I'm not proud of that stuff because I was making it in a time where I wasn't like f quite myself fully, just constantly having these negative thoughts all the time. And uh, yeah, so now we're here after literally years of hard work and uh, and uh, buckling down. I'm here. I've 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 I've, I've reached the pinnacle of of my of my aspirations. And uh, now it's time to let them come to fruition, as it were, to to start making videos again, to uh, start live streaming again, to start to try to build an audience again. So here is the current plan. As far as actual videos go, beyond this one, I don't see myself making anything anytime soon. I'm kind of living with roommates again, but um, the roommates are really cool. They're, they're good friends of mine. We uh, we kind of planned this out for a while, and uh, I'm going to be staying here for roughly another year and a half. Uh, and so while I'm here making videos, while technically possible, I'd have to be like 
you know, take it out of the house and go somewhere kind of things where I take my camera and uh, do some sort of um, uh, vlog thing out there. What I don't, I don't think they would be very interesting though, because for the most part, like if I leave the house, I'm going to go do like laundry or to go take a shower or um, go grocery shopping. So like, like taking, taking, taking the camera, like, Hey, what's going on, you guys? It's Cadet Caboose, and today we're going shopping at Walmart. <laughs> could you imagine how silly that video would be? Like, I could only do that so many times before people were like, okay, John, we don't need to know every time you go to Walmart. <laughs> so I don't see myself um, working on YouTube videos quite right away, but there will be times that I'll want to make a video about something. I actually have something that I do want to make a video about. I, I bought this, um, here, hold on, let me grab it. Look at this beauty. So, uh, it's, uh, it's for, it's, it's Legos, but it's, 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 it's not Legos. You see how this has not Legos? Um, it's a Halo Infinite Master Chief helmet on a stand with a uh, Cortana uh, chip, which the lights, come on, come on, get it. There we go, L uh, Cortana chip. They also make a um, uh, 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 an energy sword, but I thought the energy sword would too, be too tempting to, you know, try to swing around because it was like full size. This thing is like a smaller kind of a deal, but I'd like to, uh, I'd like to build that. I'd like to build that for a video someday. Y'all ever think they should make a holiday called Someday? Like, uh, every four years on February 29th, we call that holiday Someday, where you get all of the things done that you've been putting off until you'll get it done someday. I stole that from a book. <laughs> so before as well, I was working on um, a lightsaber, sort of. I am, I was learning, you know, I was, I was soldering together LEDs and making a thing and trying to make it into a lightsaber, a Kylo Ren lightsaber. And I was having so much fun doing that. And I had to stop doing that. And I was bummed out that I never got to keep working on that. And I still am a little bit bummed out that I never got to keep working on that. I would like to make um, or try to make a lightsaber uh, uh, build as well. Um, I I like to work with my hands. I like to build stuff. So I think that would be a lot of fun. But once again, that's sort of a someday kind of a project. Uh, right now, I just I kind of want to concentrate on the live streaming thing just to kind of get everything started. But as we go, I want to start making more videos and and there'll be there will be a point where I'm going to be moving out of here. We don't know exactly when that point in yet, is yet, but the goal is uh, is for me to um, get my own place, get a house. Um, it's like, it's one of the aspirations that I've had on my, I've had like, I have, I've got like a list of like 25 uh, aspirations that I couldn't even tell you because uh, like I put them on the list and then out the, in one ear, out the other, but they're in there. And when I think about them, it's like, oh yeah, I'm still working towards that thing. And one of the things that I'm working towards is getting a house. I have had to rely on others to keep a roof over my head my entire life. And when I say rely on others, I don't mean be a leech on them, but rather like I've paid other people to live with them. So um, I've, I've, I've lived with roommates. I've, I've lived with a uh, family. Uh, I had um, a girlfriend one time, if you can believe it. I always split the rent or, or paid somebody to stay at their place. I'm almost 30. I don't want to continue to sort of, you know, couch surf. That's not exactly what I've been doing, but you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to, I don't want to be doing that into my thirties. And so I, my next kind of big goal, and that's what I'm focusing on now is to buy a house before I turn 30. It gives me about a year and a half, a lot of pressure, but I mean, by my estimations, I should be able to do it. It it's, should be doable. And I'm not counting on any kind of like stream revenue or anything like that. I don't expect to make any money on the streams. I spent all of this money because I enjoy doing this. Uh, everything that you guys saw, the setup, the, uh, the, the monitors, my camera, the lights, everything. I spent that money not because I thought I was going to make my money back, but because I enjoy doing this. I don't care that it delays me buying a house like by, you know, four or five months. So I go, you know, maybe a little bit into my 30s, but I won't be 31 before I buy a house. I guarantee it. I know where I know where my finances are at and everything unless I have some sort of catastrophic like life event. 
that completely obliterates my savings account. Don't you worry about me. I'm going to be all right. I'm not trying to get famous. I mean, it would be nice, but I'm not trying to get famous. I know I'm not that entertaining. But if I can bring joy to like 15 or 20 people on a regular basis, that's awesome. That's my goal. And that's really sort of the whole point of this. Like, like all of this stuff is just to like entertain my audience, people who want to watch my videos and, and see, you know, what I'm all about. So if that sounds like fun, if that sounds like uh, something that you'd like to do with me to, to follow me along this journey, and maybe this is your first video, or maybe this is your, I don't know how many videos I have on my channel, like 54th <laughs> video. Welcome. Welcome to the journey. Thank you for joining me with it. And, uh, you know, if you are new here and you want to see more, you want to see my live streams, or you want to see some of those Walmart vlogs, <laughs> hit the subscribe button. Let's go. The goal is to stream every evening between um, 7 p.m. and 9 p.m. Eastern Standard, or no, not Eastern, um, Pacific Standard Time. So if you're on the East Coast, that's going to be super late, I know, but uh, uh, not too bad for everyone else. There'll be an hour to two hours uh, each night, or, or Monday through Friday, once I get on the regular schedule. Uh, right now, my schedule is a little bit weird, but once I get on the regular schedule, it'll be Monday through Friday. And then Saturday and Sundays, I will take one of those days off to take care of, you know, personal matters. And then the other day, I'll be trying to do kind of longer streams during the daytime, uh, preferably somewhere around like 10 o'clock to 2 o'clock-ish. Um, but it kind of depends on, you know what uh what i have going on so the weekends are kind of iffy for me my my hope is to have longer streams on the weekends during the day but definitely monday through friday seven to nine that'll be my window that'll be my window to stream if i'm not there something's wrong with me i am sick or i am dead because i will be here monday to friday seven to nine somewhere in that window anyways um, I'm going to be working on setting up some social media accounts so that I can um, let uh, anybody who's interested uh, know when I'm streaming, uh, get notifications for that kind of thing. Um, I'd like to set up a TikTok where I could share some of my stream clips as well. I'm kind of working out how to set up a format for doing that. Um, but uh, I don't... TikTok's a new one for... I, I'm I'm almost 30. I don't know if that one's meant for me. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. I'll work on it and uh I'll I'll, uh, I'll you'll see you'll see links in the stream. Thank you everybody for watching. I really do appreciate it. I'm going to go. Bye for now.